What is going on, people? This is your friendly neighborhood B Monstrosity here with a hardcore player's first impressions of Call of Duty Ghost. <clears throat> it blows. Alright, guys. Thank you for coming out. Uh, be sure to like, uh, subscribe, favorite, and I'll catch you again next time. Alright. I'll actually give my point of view here. Um, now, as far as hardcore game modes go, I am very fucking frustrated. Uh, for two reasons. One, we only have three fucking game modes still. After the midnight patch and everything, we still have three fucking game modes. And two, uh, a lot of the people that play hardcore are going over to core and saying, well, you know, they're dropping pretty quickly and this and that and this and that. This is exactly what they want you to fucking do. Guess what's going to happen when Treyarch takes back over? They're going to put it right back to 100% health, and they're going to take a look at the hardcore playlist and say, Hey, nobody's playing hardcore. We could finally drop it. That's what we wanted to do in the first place. Fuck the hardcore people. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you guys are suckers. You're fucking suckers. Alright? What you should be doing is going over and spamming the shit out of Infinity Ward and telling them that we want our goddamn game modes. We want more than three fucking game modes uh, because, okay, Hardcore Kill Confirmed is decent. We all know Hardcore Team Deathmatch is very camper friendly, uh, as if, you know, you need more camping in this game as it is because of the huge fucking maps and all the little hidey holes that they put in the motherfucker. But, um, uh, and then you have Search and Destroy, or Search and Rescue, I'm sorry. Uh, but I've never been a big fan of Search and Destroy, so, um, not that there's anything wrong with it, it's just not my, not my personal taste. Um, so, yeah, we should be spamming the shit out of them to get Hardcore Dom, Hardcore Cranked, um, Hardcore Blitz, you know, this type of shit. But instead, you're playing right into their fucking game. Like, yeah, maybe if we only put three game modes in, they'll come over and check out core. Then we could lump everything together, and we won't have to worry about hardcore anymore. Yeah. So, basically, from a hardcore perspective, uh, Call of Duty may very well be fucking dead. 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 Um, <clears throat> if it keeps up this way, if it keeps up this way, then uh, most likely Titanfall will fuck Call of Duty up, uh, you know, take his girlfriend, take his lunch money, you know, take the keys to his car, um, just completely skull fuck it, um, okay, let's go ahead and get into my first impressions of this game, now, I was, ha I have been anticipating, all my friends know I have been anticipating this game for the longest time, I'm like, here is our savior, Infinity Ward's gonna come back, they're gonna bring their good connection, they're gonna bring their good guns, they're gonna bring their good maps, and they're gonna just save the day for hardcore especially. And I have been completely and totally let down. Actually, you know, I, I've heard a lot of people say that they are enjoying this game, but, you know, it's already kinda getting old to me. I mean, it seems like we only play like five maps, um, uh, I found a gun that I really like, and, and you know, um, so I've been using that a lot. Um, there are a lot of good guns in the game, I will give you that. But um, this camping bullshit and the way that they set up the maps, uh, if you're a rusher at heart, um, this gets very fucking frustrating. Um, the little satchels, the IED satchels are fucking a nuisance. Uh, they brought back target finders, um, just, oh man, this game is fucking frustrating. And something that I haven't heard people say is the, the, the quick up perk, or the pull up perk, whatever perk it is that allows you, uh, your gun to be ready after sprinting. Uh, I don't know what it's supposed to be ready for, but it doesn't appear to be ready for shooting. Um, uh, something is wonky with that mechanic right there because I'll, I'll I'll run around the corner, run into an enemy, and it seems like it takes me fucking forever to pull up sight and shoot him. Uh, yeah, you can you can spray, uh, but if he's a little bit too far away, you're gonna miss the fuck out of him. Um, 
so uh, as far as a rusher's perspective that is very fucking aggravating please let me know if you've noticed that mechanic uh, completely fucked up um, you know it's completely unlike all the other call of duties unlike black ops 2 to where um, you know once you quit sprinting your gun is immediately I mean you can immediately pull up sight and be ready to acquire targets uh, but they do it somewhat differently in this game. I don't understand it yet at all. And it's uh, very aggravating from somebody that consistently runs. It's like they're trying to punish people that run around the map. Uh, I don't understand where the fuck they're going with this. Um, maybe they've just spent way too much time preparing the next generation game. And they spent no time whatsoever on this fucking game. Maybe. Maybe. Uh, we'll just have to see the next gen game comes out and it, and it doesn't have any more than three game modes for hardcore then I'm I'm probably pretty much done with Call of Duty for the rest of my life I'll go play Titanfall uh, I'll I'll just not even buy the Xbox one until something decent comes out um, that's how frustrated I am right now at this fucking game and you know a lot of people saying oh well you know core is decent core is decent suckers you're a bunch of fucking suckers. You know, it's gonna go right back to the way it was. You think Infinity Ward's gonna give a shit uh, about hardcore? No. And you know, at least Infinity Ward did have the, um, uh, you know, uh, did try to, uh, you know, try to kind of sort of accommodate hardcore, lowering down the hit points. Of course, you know. I'm probably completely off base with that too, you know, they probably uh, did it for some other fucking reason, because uh, three goddamn game modes, we should be spamming the shit out of those motherfuckers, but no, you guys fell right into their trap, going over there playing fucking core modes, like a bunch of dum-dums, anyways, um, the maps, uh, they pretty much suck, I, I might have like two maps that I think are decent, but the rest of them are just full of window camping, fucking uh, uh, camper friendly fucking maps. I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. Uh, the guns are good. Uh, my favorite gun right now is the K7. It's got the integrated silencer. It's kind of like the honey badger of the submachine guns. So you don't have to waste that attachment on a silencer. And if you put the grip on that motherfucker, that's the gun that you're watching in the video right here. Put the grip on it it's fucking fantastic I highly suggest you check it out um but i don't know how long this game is gonna last um it seems like every call of duty that, that they come out with my desire to play it keeps on going down and down and down um had a little spike there even though that black ops 2 was a horrible fucking game as far as connection goes uh, you know, I played with a bunch of my buddies, so that kept it alive. But this game right here, there ain't no telling. Um, if they don't do some kind of major fix to it, uh, you know, uh, maybe change some of the mechanics. Uh, well, that's really the only mechanic that I have an issue with. Because it's like it, uh, the pull-up site thing. You know, it's like it, it punishes you for, for being quick. And that is anti Call of Duty all the way. Now, please let me know uh, if you are feeling the same thing. And another thing about that pull-up mechanic after sprinting, if you're lagging, which still happens in this fucking game because we still don't have dedicated servers, which they told us we were going to have dedicated servers, but they're like, oh no, we didn't mean this generation. We meant that you have to pay $600 to get it on the next generation. Fucking faggots. Um, anyways, um, you know, if you're lagging, then when you come around the corner, uh, you could be dead in, in a heartbeat, you know, um, but, oh man, this game is very frustrating from a rusher, from a rusher's point of view, from a hardcore player's point of view, uh, I'm very fucking aggravated at the moment, um, on a lighter note, me and G-Mac were trapping, trying out the sniper rifles. Sniper rifles are fucking smooth as silk. Uh, they are beautiful. Um, the first one that you get, the first in the top left-hand corner, I forget what it's called. 
but it is fucking beautiful. Um, you know, some machine guns are good, blah, blah, blah. I already said the guns were good. We all know the guns are good. But it's the people that use them, and it's the people that developed them that I have the fucking issue with. Where are our goddamn game modes? Where are the people stepping up to spam the shit out of these cocksuckers? Because you know they're going to fuck us. Come on, people. You know they're going to fuck us. Anyway, I'll be back with another video, maybe. I don't know. I'm going to be recording this weekend. We'll see how it goes. But for right now, I am B Monstrosity, and I'm signing the motherfucker out. <laughs>